upon your right!
tougher after all. Left side, murderer. yourself, man! <laughs> was here. Decisions, decisions.
Kratos, I've been awaiting your return. Arms up! Great beard, by the way. Your strength lives up to reputation. Shrouding your homeland in endless darkness. And you suggested there was something more to it. I did indeed, Kratos. Clear your mind, fight. Let the truth come to light. Come, show me that spark grit. 
I yield. I yield. Good then. I don't think you are indifferent, Kratos. I think you were hurt. Deeply hurt. And you handled it unskillfully. Wait. Is that you restoring the sun? You took Helios' chariot and put the sun back in the sky, but sacrificed yourself in the process. Yes. I fell to my death and was saved by Helios. But this memory happened before I killed him. My evils were yet to come. What is the point? That your legacy has always been a complicated one. That goodness is not a destination we arrive at, but a practice. Misfortune may drive anyone to darkness. We resist it only through wisdom and vigilance. You are not so unskillful now as you were then. Better voices in your head, you might call it. I think that's enough for now. You have much to contemplate. Yes. Back to the beach then. You should be proud of your progress, Kratos. See you soon. He's back. It seems like you're making progress, whatever you're doing in there. Perhaps. Listen, I... No, I made you feel like we expected more of you than you could give. And I just want you to know, I'm not asking you to change how you are or who you are. We had to break the old world to build a new one. Picking up the pieces and putting them together stronger, it's a rare opportunity. You made a difference here. In some circles, a symbol of change. On many days, just knowing that you're a part of the Council is enough. And other days. You've earned a voice. How you use it is up to you. My lady. General? <sighs> Your focus is paying off. We did more things and more things to do. Check.
air. Good. There is a secret weapon that turns challenges into triumph. And that is your ability to adapt. Valhalla is impressed. Guna. For you. Seems like every obstacle is just a stepping stone to you. Back to my story. Go on. So, there I was, little Miss Brawl Magnet. If I wasn't starting the fight, I was the first one charging in to join it. Maybe it's something in the Asgard water. But seemed like there was always a fight to be had. I guess I needed the rush, something to keep me sharp, feeling alive. I was driven without fear or frankly much sense to hold me back. Got myself a bit of a reputation, and that ended up being a problem. This notorious bully I'd humiliated held on to a grudge and tried to track me down. Found out way too easily who I was and where I lived. Set out to teach me a lesson. We'll pick it up there when you progress further. <clears throat> If Valhalla is offering some help, I'd take it. Durable improvement.
A substitute daughter. A box full of evils. This one feels important. This is your blacksmith's story, isn't it? His girl was the key, and he died protecting her? Protecting her from me. I opened that box seeking a means to kill Ares. And what I released... Pretty much turned all the gods crazy. Uh, thanks again for that. Quiet, Ed. Unfortunate. The time I spend in my own Valhalla means you get more time with him. Smith's daughter. Pandora. She reminded me of my own daughter, who I lost long ago. I'm sorry, Kratos. Even at your most vengeful, you must not have wanted to see harm come to her. Pandora was innocent. The way she saw things, she could reach me when few could. She deserved better than to be a pawn, sacrificed in a game of gods. Your regret is palpable. But thank you for letting yourself remember. That is important. Is it worth what it'll cost you? I wonder.
I've come to a decision. At least for the time being, I'm going to step back from the price Valhalla has asked of me. Good for you, Seagram. I think maybe it's time I traveled. Experienced these realms and the lands beyond. Not as Valhalla's emissary, but as a person. That's perfect. You've always dreamed of a grand sea voyage, seeing the world. Perhaps I could go with you. I've been told I'm a useful guide. Perhaps. But let's not distract Kratos further. Done, brother. You've withstood the burden.
cover. I see the one you need to get there. Great save. should be unlocked now, shall we? Yeah! 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 
brother. Hello again, Kratos! All your righteous haranguing about how evil the gods are, and you somehow gloss over that little extra nudge you gave them. Opening the box was Athena's plan. I did not know the consequences. You would claim ignorance of the consequences of trusting Athena? Is that your idea of a joke, Kratos? Because I admit it's hilarious. Uh, let's be real, Kratos. Whether you should have suspected the consequences or not, you certainly can't claim that you would have cared about them. You wanted the power to kill Ares. And because you wanted it, everything is justified. That's your moral code at the end of the day, isn't it? To imagine you once again holding an office of solemn metaphysical responsibility. A trusted figure. A worshipped figure. The absolute gall of you to let yourself consider such a thing. I guess irony can have you when it earns you or something. I don't think you can be trusted to keep that safe at all. Pretty sure he agrees with me. <laughs> <laughs> 